Hi friends, my name is Mithura and I am an Android developer. In this video, I am going to show you how you can create an Android app without using an integrated development environment that is an IDE. So you are going to create apps just using your common prompts. So please uh, don't be scared that I am going to create an app using just the command line tools and it's going to be pretty fun, trust me. If you are a beginner, then it will be an awesome series for you because you are going to learn the ins and outs of Android because you are creating an app just using your common prompt without just hitting the run button in your Android studio. So I welcome you to the world of the common line and it is pretty fun, trust me. So what you are going to learn on this course, I am going to basically summarize on this PowerPoint presentation. Uh, trust me, this is not going to be a prior presentation every time. Uh, I'm going to do a real coding and I'm going to show you how you can get dive into it. So basically, I I'm not rec I don't recommend you to leave Android Studio or Eclipse, whatever you are using currently for Android development. But I recommend you to try to create a project, create a project using your common prompt so you can really work with this project entirely uh, you and you know that what is basically happening inside and out so let me go ahead and summarize that what you are going to learn in this course so you're going to learn the how that how to create an android application without using your id that i have already said that you you're going to create an app using your integrated using without using any integrated development environment that is android studio or eclipse whatever you are using currently and i'm going to tell you about the project structure if you are using android studio already that's uh, very good uh, if you go to the left side panel and select the project you are going to see some project structure here so i'm going to talk about this and you're going to learn about the sdk directory as well and you're going to learn about the android debug bridge that how your app actually runs from android studio to your physical device and virtual device whatever you are using and i'm going to talk about flavors these are very fun things now uh, when i'm going to create flavors you're going to you're going to love it i'm going to entirely use common prompt and my simple text editor sublime text or notepad plus plus whatever works for you and uh, flavors means basically you are creating free and pro version of an app in a single app so if you you don't want to create so many apps for just for the free and basic version so you are going to stick with one app and using your android flavor you can create basic and pro version of any app and we are going to talk about the api level that is um, and already uh, in the Android uh, API is very fun stuff that is application programming interface and we're going to talk about this fun stuff as well and most importantly what we are going to learn here is just when you click the green run button in your Android studio or in the Eclipse what actually happens behind the scene and this is the fun part guys trust me just stick with me and you're going to love this course and if you like my course and videos just subscribe to my channel and i'll be keep uploading videos almost every day and please subscribe to my channel and help me grow my channel 